Alright, what is going on guys? Welcome back to yet another video on this channel. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get stretch resolution in May of 2020 on Fortnite Battle Royale. Now this method is extremely simple, you just have to know what you're doing. There's literally like two steps to this and you're completely done and you have stretch resolution. So make sure to stay tuned for the entire video and drop a like right now in the next five seconds or your resolution will be stretched. But anyway, let's get right into this. Alright, so as you can see I'm on the normal 1920 by 1080 resolution. This is what everybody plays on pretty much. But anyway, without further ado, I'm going to show you guys right now how to get that stretch resolution. But I will let you know it's a little bit different than the old stretch resolution. It doesn't really give you more field of view. It's like the same stretch resolution as before. It just doesn't give you extra field of view. I don't know anything about stretch resolution and all that stuff because I never used it. But anyway, let's get right into this. All right, so the first thing you want to do is go over to this little search bar and type percent right there. Local app data and percent and you're just going to click on this file folder and this should take you here um and best what we're going to do is go to fortnite game i'm just going to click on that double click it you know saved config windows client and basically what we're going to do is right click game user settings go to properties and i already have it unchecked for the sake of this video but it should be checked on at all times that's what i usually say um, but basically you're just going to uncheck read only and hit apply and press ok and then you're just going to double click this and basically what we're going to do is find where the resolution is and you have to be very precise with these resolution so basically what you're going to do is I'm just going to do like let's see uh, 1440 by 1080 so 1440 I can't even type there's one right there and you're going to do this one right here as well and down here there should be I haven't done this in a while so I can't really find it All right, so for some reason right here it says right there this the resolution is all weird it says like sit one seven 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 six something like that basically I'm just gonna type this in right here and it should be good to go I hope it's basically so basically with that done right there, you're just going to go to, to file right here and press save and it basically should save and you're just going to exit out of there and you're going to right click this again, go to properties once again and activate read only and apply and ok. Alright so now you're done with that you can exit out of there and basically what you can do is go to your NVIDIA control panel. Alright so basically when you're here you're going to want to go to adjust desktop size and position and basically you're going to set the scaling mode to full screen. So that means when you're in like the stretch resolution, uh, sometimes when you're in Fortnite, uh, your mouse will be hovering over something, but it won't exactly like think it's hovering over something or something like that. So basically, you're going to put on full screen so it actually is in the right spot. And so basically, when you're in that, you're just going to apply that right there and press yes. And then we're going to go to change resolution right here. I might already have 1440. Yes, yeah, so basically, what you're going to do. I already have it on here, but I'm just going to show you what to do for a new one. So you're just going to go to customize right here and create custom resolution. And you're basically just going to type in 1440 right there, but I already have it done, so I don't really need to do that. So I'm just going to click on this one and hit apply. Alright, so as you can see, it's a lot more stretched now. Now I'm not sure how to get in like 1080p. As you can see, it's not as like it's just more fuzzy than it usually is in 1920 by 1080 I see a lot of videos on it, how like they have it really clear, but I'm not sure how to do that, so let me know in the comments down below if I'm missing something. Alright, so without further ado, we can minimize this, and we can hop into Fortnite. Alright, so as you can see, we're back in on the 1440 by 1080 resolution here, and as you can see, it doesn't really give you much of a competitive advantage anymore like it used to, like the old stretch resolution, but I mean, it still looks kind of cool. I mean, you can rock it if you want. It gives you an extra FPS. It gives you an extra FPS rate, so like you can get a, quite a bit more FPS from this. I, I noticed a severe difference. Now, as you can see, I have my FPS capped out at uh, 60, but it's at 73 because I have a six-year monitor and the max mine can go out at 76, but I just put it at 73. So basically, we're just gonna load them to some creative and see what's going on. And if you guys could, please subscribe, because we are so close to 2,000 subs. I think we're, like, less than 150 away. I think we're, like, 140 away. And we are growing really, really fast right now for my channel. So make sure you guys hit that sub button right now. It really helps. All right, so as you can see, we're in my sweaty island right here. I literally just did this. And uh, as you can see, I kind of lose a little bit of view from the top to bottom. 
Now this is because the stretch resolution isn't the exact same as it used to be. It used to be more, it used to be better because you could actually see a lot more. But now that I think they took that away. Again, I don't know anything about stretch resolution and stuff like that. But um, basically, this is pretty much what it looks like on 1440 by 1080. And as you can see, I literally just started playing keyboard like a month ago. So uh, I'm kind of dog. But anyway, this is pretty much how to get um, stretch resolution on PC. Sorry for those console players out there. Um, I'm not sure if you guys want to use this. I mean, it's good for your FPS. I noticed a severe difference um, in mine. So if you guys want extra FPS and it kind of looks cool, I mean, if you want to, it's up to you. Um, but anyway, if you guys could please leave a like and subscribe right now, that would help a lot. So we are so close to 2,000 subs. So anyway, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you in the next one. Peace out.